Howdy folks. Today working on the enclosed trailer here. And uh I want to talk to you about coupler locks real quick. Now we had an old Reese coupler lock. I'll, if I remember, I'll put the uh picture of it in right here. But uh it, it was the one where you had the it was like a cast aluminum base with what represented a trailer ball you'd stick up from underneath and it had this metal u-bolt type thing that you'd shove down in there and it would lock well i never did like it i've never have liked those style they always seem to rust and get bound up and crappy but whatever but uh i'm a fan of uh, well let me cut back to that one we had to end up cutting that one off so we got a new one and i've always been a fan of kurt hitches and this is the one that they had in stock at the local advance it's the only one they had one for the smaller uh inch and seven eighths ball this is for the two and the two and five sixteenths this is kurt part number two three zero eight one and uh honestly i wasn't going to do a video on this but compared to how easy this one is compared to that other one i gotta do a video so this one how it works there's a lock and then there's a little thing you shove up from underneath and that other one was such a pain in the ass this one you can do with one hand and real quick you had to leave the key in that one it would always lock itself and you had to keep unlocking it this one you don't even need to put the key in it to function but one-handed coupler right there slide it on push up the bottom lock it come on that is freaking easy peasy same thing key in pop it on there you go it's off I hope like, this is crazy it's amazing how easy that is and you're good they have one for the for the smaller ball sizes and this is the one for the two to two uh, uh they have one for the smaller sizes this is the one for the two and two and five sixteenths inch ball Part of me wants to look to see if they have a gooseneck lock similar to this because I will probably purchase one. But just wanted to do a quick video on it. I'd pick one up if I were you. I will do a uh, length uh, review once I've used this one long enough. We'll see how the weather acts up with it. But uh, I'm thinking it'll be fine. I don't know we'll see but uh yeah just something real quick to show you so until next time stay crazy folks have a good one